Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Um, just before we continue with today's video, I just want to thank you all so much for your support on Instagram, um, YouTube, and Twitch. Yo, it is so appreciated. I really, I really love it so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. All right, in today's video, we're going to talk a little bit about the Nanoleaf. Right here, the Nanoleaf light panels. And here we have the nine light panels pack. So this was bought for me by my wife as a uh, early birthday gift. Shout out to the wife. So we're going to talk a little bit about it and we're going to go through the setup process of how I put it up on my wall um, and a little bit of how the rhythm edition works out. All right, so let's go into the unboxing. So the first thing you see when you remove the um, sleeve of the box is the actual box itself that contains the nano leaf. All right, so opening it up, the first thing you see is an inspiration leaflet together with the starter guide in all languages. Next, you'll get the nine nano leaf panels. And these panels are a triangular shape and they're separated with like this a sheet paper which kind of stops them from scratching each other. The back of the panels have three attachments for the connectors. Here we have the power connector that connects the wall power to the nano leaf itself, together with the power brick. Here we have the three pin wall connector. It also comes with a two pin. This is the rhythm module that connects to the nano leaf, as well as nine individual connectors to connect each of the nano leaf panels. And of course, double sided tape. So, my wife and I, we actually came up with a design uh, that we laid out on the table. Um, just a random design, nothing particular, nothing special. Just something that we thought would look nice on the wall, but uh, with the idea of buying more panels in the future to actually add on. So over here we were finding the right placement for the first leaf to see the uh, best angle and the best placement to place it. So as you can see there are actually tabs that stick out and these are the ends of the double sided tape. So these ones are the ones that you pull to release the um, double sided tape off the wall so it doesn't peel anything, it doesn't peel any paint, it doesn't hurt the wall itself. The only issue I ran into actually with this was that I was unable to connect the panel seamlessly because the tabs were kind of blocking and crossing each other and that's the, that's the mistake I made with, with all this because I did not pre-plan on the placement of the double sided tape because you can see I was struggling with just three now here I got the fourth one on and I was still struggling I had to cut the tape at certain angles and the placement was all off so right after I hit the fourth one I was like I need to redo this so what I did in the end was I flipped the whole design upside down, facing down on the table. And I started laying out where the tape would go so that it would not cross each other so that I could just seamlessly put everything together without any worry. Now, luckily for me, the clock was on the desktop screen. So you can clearly see how quickly this went as compared to the first four panels I had put on. Just like that the design was done within a few minutes with the pre-planning so that's the rhythm module i attach on the far left together with the power module at the bottom
here on the NanoLeaf application. You want to click on to more and then devices. Over here, click on the plus icon at the bottom and select what kind of NanoLeaf panels you have. Click on start pairing. You can find the pairing code on your starter kit guide. Once paired, you need to name your device. The application will already know the layout of your device. And then choose the orientation of how your light panels are laid out. To control the lights, you want to click on Dashboard. Here is when you can change all the lighting effects, add scenes and add basic colors. Now let's say you have multiple nano leaf panels in the house and you want to separate them by rooms. Click on add room, name it, and to assign the nano leaves according to the room, just click on the edit icon. Just drag and drop and you're good to go. Alright guys, that was the video. The lights look amazing. It's so bright, it's so colorful, it looks so good. Uh, they also work with Google Assistant and um, Amazon Alexa as well uh, and they work together with like this uh, multiple apps um, called the Apple Home Kit and the IF Triple T which is an application that allows you to put multiple apps into one and operate it out of one application which is pretty neat but yeah if you like the video leave a like and subscribe um, I'll catch you guys in the next one peace